After receiving the news, George Sr. goes to the hospital. Brenda says Mary went to lunch when he asks on George Jr. and Mary. Brenda wants to go, but George urges she stay. Mary enters while they flirt and notes their odd behavior. Pastor Rob arrives, which enrages George Sr. like Brenda enrages Mary. Their four-way fight generates a hospital scene. In the turmoil of Mandy's water break, George Sr. forgets Missy and Brenda forgets Billy from school. Missy is upset when Billy advises that George Sr. and his mother be shared in the chicken coop. George Jr. goes to the hospital after carrying Mandy is in labor when he gets home. Mima meets Mandy while hospitalized for hemorrhoids. Mandy tells Mima her predicament once she asks, and she's thrilled. Mary and George are squabbling as Mandy's parents arrived at the hospital. Mandy's mother says they don't help her when she wants them and visits her. Sheldon spots George Jr. outside the hospital. George says he's afraid of fatherhood when Sheldon asks. George offers to transport Sheldon to his database's event because he's terrified. George Sr. stops and turns the vehicle around, coming back back to the hospitals with Sheldon to see his daughter's birth, when Sheldon begins shouting about the way he would have regretted missing it forever. The Coopers and Mandy's parents are in her hospital room, and tension is intense. George Jr. kicks everyone out as he arrives. George Jr. enters the waiting area to announce his daughter's birth. He also says they named the child Constance. Following that, everyone seems happy. George Sr. agrees when Mary says she'll stay with her mother the night. Sheldon is unhappy after discovering from Dr. Sturgis that they had received no subscribers and that their database failed, and he tells his parents.